Hey cuties, so in today's role playing video, we're in Brookhaven, but there's no school. go to dumb school. It just takes up precious time that I could be doing something else like way more important. Like sleeping? Exactly. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna try and get a few more minutes. Oh no, I want you out of the bed in 30 seconds. I am going downstairs to put the coffee on, but when I get back, your butt better be out of this bed. Uh, Alright, just five more minutes. A few moments later. Mackenzie! Mom, oh my gosh, there's no need for that. You could've just asked me nicely, jeez. Oh yeah, cause you reacted so well to me asking you nicely earlier. Come on, let's go. We're gonna be late, and if you miss the bus, I am not driving you. Ugh, my life would be so much easier if I didn't have to worry about going to stinking school. Well honey, the good news is you're not alone. Every child on the planet has to worry about going to stinking school, as you so kindly put it. Well, it's just not fair. It's not like learning what a rhombus is or how to get the slope of a line is gonna help us in the real world. Well, sure it is. Oh yeah? How? Okay, well, maybe I don't have the exact answer as to how, but that's only because I haven't had my coffee yet. Sure, Mom, blame it on the coffee. Oh, I will. You keep melting off, little lady, and I will make you sleep at school. Yikes, you really are grouchy without your coffee, aren't you? Mackenzie? Okay, okay, I'm going, I'm going. You don't have to get yourself in a tizzy, mother. You're gonna see a real tizzy if you don't start moving even faster. Now, come on. Ugh, will this whole school thing ever end? Moments later. Hey, girly! Boy, do you look like a mess! Wow, thanks, Sky. Good morning to you, too. I have been waiting for forever. You do realize that we have school today, right? Ugh, school. Even the word is getting to me. School. It's like cool, but it isn't. You want to tell me what this is about? Because I feel like it's something. Do you ever wonder what life would be like if we didn't have to go to school? Do I ever think about it? Only like every day. That's what I usually think of when I'm drifting off to sleep at night. And of course, when my alarm rings in the morning to go to school, it's a huge disappointment. Yeah, no kidding. I just feel like school is like a dead end. It's like we're not really learning anything. What's the point? Uh, to go to college, I guess. Exactly. The point of going to school is to go to more school. Make it make sense, Sky. Yeah, it never really made sense to me either, but don't we just have to do it because everyone else does it? Okay, that's not a good enough reason to do something, Sky. Just because everyone else does it? I mean, that's what our parents tell us at least. I mean, what would happen if we just didn't go to school? I think the school officer would come after us. Come on, that's what they used to tell our parents when they were kids, just to scare them. But honestly, there's no such thing. Ugh, and here we are. If I was the mayor of this place, there would be no school. There would be no fractions. There would just be good things. Well, too bad Ronald Stump won't step aside and give you his chair. I know you don't want to, girly, but it's easier to just rip the band-aid off. Wait, wait a second. Sky, did you just see that? Huh, what? See what? There, off in the distance. It's a shooting star. Oh my gosh, Sky, it's a shooting star in the middle of the day. It's gotta be like the bestest luck ever. Quick, make a wish. Okay, I made my wish. Now let's go in. Okay, I wish. Girly! All right, all right, I'm done. Let's go to class now. I made my wish. Moments later. All right, class, I am gonna pass out the daily pop quizzes. Remember, keep your eyes on your own papers. And remember to show your work, even though I just said, and I will say it again, no wandering eyes. Girly, what did you wish for on the shooting star? And also, no talking. No talking is another big part of this. Sky, shush. Oh, come on, girly, just tell me. Sky, be quiet. You're gonna get us in trouble. This is the last warning about no talking. Just whisper it really quick. No, I'm not gonna whisper it. Besides, it's not like it's ever gonna come true anyway, so there's no point of even repeating it. The next morning. <sighs> Wait, what the heck? My alarm didn't go off. I am gonna be so late for school. <gasps> it's already 10 o'clock. I'm surprised my mom hasn't chopped my head off yet. Mom, mom. Whoa, where's the fire? It's gonna be coming out of my ears in a second. Mom, you didn't wake me up. After yesterday, are you trying to teach me a lesson or something? Because this is so not funny. What, honey, 
What are you talking about? You were making me late for school. Duh. School? What's school? Oh, real funny. Just because I've been late one or two or maybe three days doesn't mean I don't know what school is. No, seriously. Honey, are you feeling okay? What is this school that you speak of? Is it like a new store at the mall? What? You know, Mom, school. The place I go eight hours every day for nine months of the year. Some might refer to it as a prison for children. Okay, I'm serious gonna need to feel your forehead and see if you have a fever now because you are talking crazy. Mackenzie, honey, you don't go anywhere during the day. Wait, huh? Okay, I guess I'll play along. So then what do I do all day when you're at work? I don't know. I assume just like play Roblox. And what do the rest of the kids in the world do? I'm guessing the same thing. Honey, what kids do when their parents aren't home isn't really my worry. Right now, my worry is that my daughter is talking like a crazy person. Hold on a second. Are you telling me that you have no idea what school is? All right, that's it. I am calling the doctor. Uh, you're sick. No, 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 no. Hang on. Just bear with me here. So how do kids nowadays get an education? Like, pretend I'm an alien who just crashed and landed on home planet. And now you've got to explain to me how things work. Well, you certainly are starting to act like one. Just play along, please. Okay, alien child. I guess kids don't get an education. They don't need one. So then what happens when they turn 18? Nothing. They just go to work with their parents. I mean, what do they need to know? Rhombuses and the slopes of a line? What good is that going to do in the real world, honey? <gasps> Oh my god, what have I done? What? What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. Look, Mom, I really have to try and fix something. I'll be back later after school. I mean, uh, I'll just be back later. Jeez, that kid is weird. Later that same evening. What have I done? What have I done? I wish that there was no such thing as school on a shooting star. And then when I woke up, there was no school. Oh, no. I wish for all the school to go away, but not all of the education. How did the universe get this so wrong? Officer George, why are the police here? Oh, you know, this building is a abandoned and since kids nowadays have nothing to do they break in here and cause trouble wait so this building is abandoned it's not used for educational purposes at all what reason would children need an education no they usually just make trouble all day i sure wish there was something for them to go to do maybe then the juvenile crime rate wouldn't be so high oh geez it just keeps getting worse you pull one domino and they all keep falling oh my gosh Wow, there really is nobody in here. <gasps> hey, Mr. Teacher Man, sir. Oh, thank God. Uh, do I know you? What did you just call me? You're my teacher, remember? Yeah, well, you must have confused me with someone else. I clean the floors in this abandoned building because apparently there's no job for a guy who only knows how to do math. I mean, what skill is that going to get me? Oh, no, 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 no. What have I done? A few moments later. <laughs> take per day? Four. Duh. It's not like I have anything else to do. Okay, forget that. We need to talk. It's super important. Oh, please. Come in. Okay, what's going on, girly? You're really starting to freak me out a little bit. Okay, Sky. I really need you to listen to what I'm about to say. And please believe me, even though you're gonna think every word that is about to come out of my mouth is completely insane. Can you just do that for me, please? Uh, I guess. We are living in an alternate universe and it is all my fault. Life isn't supposed to be like this. There's supposed to be a place we go to every day called school. It's a place that we go to learn and grow and basically get taught everything that we need to know about the real world. I was mad about it because I had to wake up early, so then I wished on a shooting star that school would go away. But then when I woke up, it actually had gone away. And now that it has, I see that we need it deeply in order to survive. Okay? When we were in school, there was order and structure, and now all these kids' brains are turning into mush. They are rotting on the couch, and there's mayhem in the streets. I didn't think school is important, but apparently it's what keeps us going. And now it's gonna be gone, all because of my dumb wish. I just really need you to help me get it back. Okay, well, how are we gonna do that, especially if nobody else believes that it exists? Well, I'm glad that you asked, because I have a plan. Are you in? I mean, I never realized how important school was, but now that I do, we need to save it. Eh, sure. I'm bored anyways. Two hours later. Ew, so why are we here in this gross abandoned building anyways? Yeah, I don't know what this place is, but I have a bad feeling being here. It's like it holds the souls of lost 
children. Let me just hit the light switch in this place. All right, thank you for starting us off, Ashley. And for that rather frightening visual, Ayla. We are here because I wanted to pitch a vision to all of you. I already hate it. Can I go back to cleaning the floors now? No, you may not. <clears throat> I want you all to envision a place where children go every day from ages 5 to 18. A place where they go maybe not so willingly and learn about everything that they need to know about life. We'll call it school. Oh gosh, here we go again. School will be sectioned up in different rooms, kind of like this one. And throughout the day, you'll shuffle through math, English, history, science, and more. And once you're done the 13 years, you'll get a piece of paper that states that you completed everything. And then you'll graduate. So does anyone have any questions? Yeah, I have one. Uh, that sounds lame, and why would we need it? Well, to be honest, at first I thought it was lame too. The more I thought about it, the more I realized that we're the future, and being educated is is the best thing that we could do for the next generation. And that all starts with learning. And that starts with school. The next day. <sighs> Mackenzie, what are you still doing in bed? Come on, you're gonna be late for school. Wait, I am? Yes, now come on, get moving. Oh, thank God.